Welcome back students. In the previous video, I tried to explain positive, comparative and superlative with the use of a few specific examples. And this is the continuation of the first video. Now taking the example of the second one, Ram is one of the tallest boys in the class. Now when you understand this, Ram is one of the tallest boys in the class, certain things come to your mind. I mean to say, if this is the class and you say Ram is the Ram is one of the tallest boys in the class, you also mean there are other boys in the class who have similar height with Ram. There may be other boys in the class who are shorter than Ram, but there are certainly a few other boys in the class who have the, who have similar height with Ram. Now, taking this, when you change this particular sentence in the comparative, you have to keep the same meaning and then change. You write it in this way. Ram is taller than most other boys in the class. If you consider this to be Ram, you say Ram is taller than most other boys in the class. You mean to say there are other boys in the class who are shorter than Ram. Now, taking this and changing it into positive degree, you say very few boys in the class are as tall as Ram. Khub pom shom khuk chilera aache class e jara Ram e shoman shoman Lomba. Very few boys in the class are as tall as Ram. This is the way we need to change into from positive to comparative and comparative to superlative degree. Now, taking the example, the third type, where you do not have the superlative degree, you have only the positive and the comparative degree in this third type of degree of comparisons. One Ram and Shram. You say, Sham is, Ram is taller than Sham. Ram is taller than Sham. Ram is taller than Sham. And when you change this particular sentence into positive, you say in the other way. You say, Sham is not so tall as Ram. You say, Sham is not so tall as Ram. This is the third type of degree of comparisons. I hope when you understand these three examples, there shall be no further trouble when you do it actually in your papers. So thank you. Thank you all the students for watching the video. I shall be sending you a few exercises which you need to complete and then submit in the group. Thank you. Thank you very much.